Hola, hello. Como esta? Bonjour. This is Miss Chic. A S M R. And welcome to our channel. It will be my birthday in a couple of days, so to celebrate, I'm going to be making a big ASMR group collab with my subscribers. This video is going to have over an hour of ASMR triggers and role plays with my subscribers from around the world. Everyone's channels will be linked in the description box below and in the pinned comment. I hope that you enjoy our tingly party. To start off, I will be doing some of my most requested triggers from you. The first one is leather jacket sounds. I'm wearing a leather jacket today and it's covered in black lace. It's actually faux leather. And it's got these zips. Another trigger that I get asked to do, especially more recently, is with my trigger board that I made myself. And last but not least, I'm going to be eating your face. So you are my birthday cake. My yummy, yummy birthday cake. And I'm going to be eating you all up. Skus, 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 skus. Are those sprinkles yummy? Is that chocolate custard? Is that chocolate custard? It looks like chocolate custard. Let me guess. Let me guess. Let me get some of that chocolate, ch 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 chocolate, ch 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 chocolate, 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 ch 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 chocolate custard. Hmm. Let's carry on with this tingly party. Ew, what 
kind of little thing is that? I call it... What is it? Hmm... Is it a rat? Or maybe a little person? Whatever it is, it does not belong in my home. Oh, it's ugly, isn't it? No, not that ugly. Almost. I don't know. What shall I do with it? Oh, I'll put it in a little plastic bag. Hmm. Yes, that will be its new home. Let's see. Hmm. I hope you will like your new little home. Here we go. Oh. You're in the bag soon. Yes, yes, yes. There we go. I take a little better look at this creature. Hmm. I wonder, I wonder if it is a kind of alien or maybe some kind of mutant. I'm not sure I like it very much. Maybe I should just put it out of its misery. Hmm. Much to ponder, much to ponder. But I wonder, maybe it is a kind of fairy. A hairy fairy, maybe. Or a little tiny werewolf. It is a little bit cute, I must say. Hey, you. Hey. Well, put it out of its misery. I'll just take it out of the bag and put it on the floor. Hmm. Maybe I should just... Yes, maybe I should just... No. No, it's pretty cute. Yes, scurry along, you little scallywag.
stay perfectly still. Stay perfectly still for me. <laughs> I'm just going to use the stethoscope. Just going to use the stethoscope to listen to your heartbeat. Okay. I'm just going to be listening to your heartbeat right now. Just going to be listening to your heartbeat. Oh, that's quite, quite a good heartbeat you have there. Quite strong and rhythmic. Uh, quite, a, quite, a, quite a strong. That is quite. That is quite a strong and rhythmic heartbeat that you have there. Excellent. But I have determined the problem with you. You have blocked ears, don't you? Not fully blocked, of course. You can still hear me right now, can't you? Hello. Hello there. Yes. Yes, I believe you can still hear me right now, can't you? Hello. Hello there. Yes. So, not fully blocked, but partially blocked ears. Now, I have just what the doctor ordered, and that is a magical solution to be put into your ears. Okay, let me grab it and let me shake it up for you first.
que os haya gustado. Muchas gracias a todos. Un abrazo. Chao.
sunscreen flavor. Nice touch. Sombre grey. The stars seem colder in their nightly climb as winter. 
winter settles in and steals the day. The roads grow quiet, distant echoes fade. No footsteps hurry through the darkened street. And as the world is wrapped in winter's shade, the silent snow descends in steady sheets. Each flake a whispered promise from the sky of sleep, of peace, and stillness pure and true. It lands on frozen soil, soft as a sigh, erasing autumn's fiery scarlet hue. Beneath this white, the earth begins to dream of future springs, of flowers yet to rise. And though the land is hushed, it softly schemes of warmer days beneath the icy skies. But now the world is wrapped in winter's hold, a silvered sleep. A quiet frozen breath. The trees wear crowns of frost instead of gold. And all things wait as life succumbs to death. Yet death is just a pause in nature's course. A resting phase where life retreats within. For buried deep the seed retains its force. And even in this frost new life begins. The fox retreats into its sheltered den. The bear now slumbers deep beneath the snow. The woods that once were full of bustling men lie empty, waiting for the cold to go. And we too feel the weight of winter's hand as days grow dark and nights stretch on too long. We sit beside the fire, no grander plan than waiting out the storm, both fierce and strong. The fire's glow reflects on tired eyes, the world outside a realm of frozen light. And though the season stills the earth and skies, there's comfort found within this endless night. For in the heart of winter's frozen core, there lies a truth we seldom dare to speak. That endings lead to openings once more, and every peak gives away to yet another peak. So let the frost consume the autumn's flame. Let silent rain where once the wind would cry. For in this stillness nothing stays the same. What dies today, tomorrow will supply. The winter's breath, though cold, is not unkind. It holds the promise of a future bright. For when we face the icy grip we find that spring will always follow winter's night. So rest, dear earth, beneath your snowy veil, and slumber through the season's endless sleep. The time will come for buds to split their shells, for now the cold is yours alone.
with one of my favorite perfumes sunflowers dream petals smells nothing like flowers smells nothing like sunflowers and it smells like marshmallows I say it smells like s'mores because do marshmallows have a smell? If you burn them, they do.
next trigger is books, specifically Goosebumps by R.L. Stein. I just think the illustration is so, I would say beautiful, even though it is more so horror. Legend of the Lost Legend is about Vikings. That's not solely about Vikings. Why I'm afraid of bees. Ain't everybody except for beekeepers, of course.
So that's all for today's Dingly Dingly Collab. Please remember to click on like, leave a comment and subscribe if you found it dingly and relaxing. And I have linked everybody's channels in the video description and the pinned caption below. So remember to check out the channels of everyone involved. And I would like to say a huge thank you to all my subscribers who joined in this collab. And I will see you, I will see you, I will see you in our next video. Good night, good night, good night.